Hello everyone, today we will learn about uh, how to make an organic pesticide. So it is completely organic except for the addition of this uh, liquid soap which primarily consists of lime, so which is also okay. So otherwise it is completely organic. So the ingredients for the organic uh, pesticide uh, is are chilies. You can get some dried chilies uh, uh, f that that you're not using. So you can use these chilies. Then you can use some garlic that you're not using. You can you can put it as a whole. Then uh, these small onions. So these can also be put. And then uh, garlic. So these are all pungent, so these uh, make the insects, uh, you know, the, the insects will, uh, the aphids and all the other uh, organisms that uh, are a pest in the garden. So these, uh, they, they don't like the smell of these things. So, and uh, the heat from all these things actually, uh, you know, uh, kill them. So you can use all these uh, ingredients. So now we will have to grind these things into... Uh, a, a, a paste and then add water and then you have to uh, sieve it sieve it and retain only the water so I'll just show you how to do that so we have a grinder which already has a mixture of uh, all these things ground in it so you add all these ingredients see these are all stale chilies you can use it you don't have to use fresh chilies you can use all stale materials put all these things inside so now you can switch on fine consistency <coughs> it is really pungent as in you can't uh, you can't really smell it so you can imagine the effects on the insects so next we will uh, need to add this now we will uh, need to sieve this so, so I will, you just have to sieve it and then you will get, uh, so once you sieve this mixture, you will get something like this. So you will get this, uh, you will get this liquid uh, which has all the uh, chilies and the garlic and the, uh, and the ginger and everything, all the extracts. So now you will have to transfer it to another jug so that you sieve it really well. So I'm transferring these things into a jug. So after a few minutes of straining, so you can double strain it just so that uh, all the solid particles uh, can be sieved. 
so after that you will have to add a little bit of uh, baking soda uh, a pinch of baking soda so again this uh, this provides the exothermic reaction this provides the heat and you can add a small amount of baking soda into this mixture and then the only chemical if you could call it chemical ingredient would be this uh, liquid soap so it contains lemon and uh, all the other ingredients which uh, actually uh, you know dissolve the skin of uh, these aphids and other uh, insects so you know these help in uh, uh, you know getting it gets into their skin and irritates them and kills them at the end so this is very important so just take a spoonful because we do not want uh, the mixture to be frothy so take a little bit of soap very little quantity i've just taken so much and then add it after adding it big stick and then stir it see to it that the liquid does not become frothy if it becomes frothy it becomes very difficult to spray it on the on the plants so stir it well so give it a clockwise and an anti clockwise stir see it is not very frothy it is like it is not very frothy, so this is how it should be, the consistency. So after this is done, leave it to settle down and then after it is settled, after the liquid is settled, pour it into a sprayer like this, open the nozzle and again if you want to strain it, you can put a muslin cloth over it and then strain it even more and then add it into this and then you can spray it on the plants so this is an effective way of uh, killing aphids and uh, spider mites etc which affect uh, uh, the plants so this will not uh, this is not this is not uh, this is not a ha harmful chemical at all so it does not kill uh, kill all those beneficial insects like ladybirds and stuff like that so those are beneficial insects so they, they are not killed by all these things so aphids and spider mites these these are the insects which are uh, you know uh, rampant uh, in gardens so this uh, this organic insecticide will help kill those insects only and uh, butterflies and uh, the bees and all uh, will not be affected uh, you know uh, if you spray this organic uh, ingredient so thank you for watching please try this at home and please subscribe